Dope Boy TV gang, man, stand up, man. I need y'all to like this video. Make sure y'all go follow me on all my social medias, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Check the description for it. You already know how we stepping out here, man. We ain't ducking nothing. We got the topics on the flow for today. Okay, man, we're going to do a couple shout outs before we get into the topics on the flow. The first shout out is going to go to Chicago Overlord. I want y'all to go tap into everybody's channel. Then we got Professor the menace man y'all make sure y'all go show all these people some love man even if y'all gotta tell them that dope boy tv sent y'all and this my very good buddy man a day one to the channel man and y'all better go follow him man i swear to jesus because i'm following him as well it's my boy j mac man he make all type of great stuff on this channel y'all just go check it out because i ain't gonna tell y'all because i want y'all to see what he got to show but let's get back into the topics on the flow which is baby joe okay man we gotta speak on this new song baby joe just made so baby joe just made a song it's called do my thing so his song looked like it was just a straight message to the ops delivering them a message man he spoke on the situation on the police pulling up the feds whatever you want to call them on the block arresting everybody and it seemed like they not gonna get enough of this and seven harder way you know saying that he snort tar and you know do hair run and things of that nature and it sounded like either now this is where i'm gonna need y'all help because it, it's crazy to me because he's talking about somebody touching down and usually when people be like touch down and mean like coming back for to coming back from home from jail most likely because it's two people who sh soon should be coming home which is free cleasy in fl dissa so he called he was like man when the f uh, when the fat b word touched down man we gonna catch him and he was like for the uh, at first i thought he was speaking on seven hardaway until he had another bar in his song he was like man for the dude that all we all know you know play with his nose man blase 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 and it's crazy to me because I wouldn't be surprised if he talking about Clizzy 5, but I really do think he talking about Dissa because this is supposed to be coming home. And if anybody know about this beef about Bottom Boys and TBG and how people quote unquote say it started, let's just say Boozilla rest in peace had a problem with g money rest in peace and it's people all around that was key players in this situation but long story short dissa and buzilla had a real problem in the streets you feel me and they was getting into it whoop de whoop who is buzilla right hand man <laughs> Baby Joe. Baby Joe was around thugging it with him. Rest in peace to Buzillo before he passed away. You get what I'm saying? And I'm pretty sure he still want to catch bruh because he was speaking on his bro name. You get what I'm saying? That man got a Buzilla name tatted on his neck. But then again, you know, Baby Joe is one of the people who very outspoken. He going to speak his mind and he going to tell people he be always dissing the hops. So if it's not you feel me, Dissa, I would think it's Cleasy 5 because a lot of people, if y'all stay tuned to my channel, I have reposted when they were, you know, on Cleasy 5 Live while he was in prison, you feel me, talking about, you know, they was all doing the 5, saying free 5, this and that, and, you know, 5 even said out of his own mouth, like, they put 30000 on my head, man, I got a security guard and all type of stuff, you feel what I'm saying? But, I mean, right now it's all messages and stuff, I mean... He telling people to come home, basically making it seem like, you know, we all know some people don't be out there like that. But he making it seem like nobody be out there. Seven, Yoshi, and then, you know, the other people who going to touch down later this year, hopefully, or at the beginning of next year. Because Seven need supposed to be coming home and this supposed to be coming home like November, like sooner than later. So that's why I just think he talking about this. But y'all let me know how y'all feel about this situation down in the comments. You know I'm rocking. It's your boy, Dope Boy TV. And if you're rocking with me, subscribe. If not, kick rocks. And I will be having a part two coming to this video. I'm going to keep y'all updated and tune in.